Yankees are over and they have brought everybody, except for Gary Sanchez, but everybody else is in Clearwater to take on the Phils. We said the big boys were here. They're they all here. Def definitely here. And we said Gary Sanchez, the only one that's not here, but Higashioka, who's batting ninth, facing Matt Moore, who used to face the Yankees all the time when he was with the Tampa Bay Rays. Brian Wills behind home plate. Dan Iasoni is the crew chief. He's over first. Line drive, base hit it to left field. So he took the 3-2 pitch, and LeMayu picks up his 10th hit of the spring. You have to remember here, Tom, this is like one of, rated one of the best pitchers oh, in all of baseball early in his career. Ruben, that could be the longest home run we have seen hit in Clearwater in quite some time. That went out of the entire ballpark. There are cars parked be beyond the Tiki Bar that are in trouble right now. I mean, that was crushed. Yeah, he hit the entire ball. He tried to get that fastball in on him right here, and he got one two pitch. Foul down the right field line. Harper's giving it a look. Oh, no, it's going to stay fair. And Harper will get it in towards second. It'll be a double for Hicks, who's warming up. Popped up. Shallow center. That's going to be a tough play. Oh, what a play by D.D. Gregorius. Sliding with his back to the infield. And he picked it right off out of the air. Just a, 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 an outstanding play, and this is exactly what an infielder has to do. You just turn and run and you... Foul tip, ball cut. And there are two outs. First strikeout for Moore. Well, here's Zach Warren, Jersey's own Zach Warren. At ball four, that puts runners on first and second. Oh, that's been huge for, particularly for, for Zach Eflin. Swing and a miss, 92. And the side is retired. So Urshela goes down on strikes. McCutcheon leads it off. He's the DH. JT bats second. Then Bryce Harper and Reese Hoskins. Alec Bohm fifth. D.D. Gregorius sixth. They'll face Michael King, who's had a decent spring. He's been working on a third pitch. This is his sixth game, third start in spring training. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. That is the last thing we want to see have happen. He got up quickly. JT hits it toward left field. That'll be in for an extra base hit. It takes a couple hops off the wall. McCutcheon to third. He'll be held there. And a double puts runners on second and third with nobody out here in the bottom of the first inning. Outside ball four. That'll load the bases up for Reese Hoskins. And he gets hit with a breaking ball. And that'll force in a run. So it's a 2-1 ball game. Second batter that's been hit in this inning. Sinker, what you call backdoor, and he does the same thing to the left-hander on his right hip. Off the hands. Nice play at second base by LeMahieu. They get one at second, and a run will score. It's a 2-2 game. As JT crosses the plate. 2-2 to Didi. That one's in the air to right field. It's deep. Going back on it is Judge. Back to the wall. It is gone! On to the berm, a three-run his third homer of the spring, and the Phillies take the lead here in the bottom of the first inning. Really impressive job of swinging the bat in situations right here. As I said, Alec Bohm kind of set this up by keeping runners in scoring position and keeping this the line moving here. He said, I think it's going to be a fun year. This is McCutcheon the other day. And that one's going to sneak into left center field, a base hit for Segura who's going to try for two. He was hustling out of the box, and he's got a double. Swing and a miss. Second out of the inning. That one toward the end of the bat. Higashioka will give way to Voigt. And the inning is over. But the Phillies do score five runs. Matt Moore in a game. And there's an off-speed pitch and a good one. That's the second strikeout for Moore. Pitches and then getting the, the quick out. And there's a line drive base and it's a center field. A breaking ball that he just hung out in the middle of the plate. LeBay is two for two. Based on what he is able to, go, to have accomplished over there. Well, this is a much better inning for Matt Moore. He threw 10 pitches this inning. Both pitched well. It's one of those situations where you almost wish you didn't have, as a player, you almost wish you didn't have options. <laughs> That's true. But it, it selfishly, 
as an organization, you, know, you love to be able to keep all of your assets. That is the third batter that King has hit. Two home runs, five extra base hits. That ball is grounded through the hole on the right side. Rounding third, held there is McCutcheon. Yeah, the bases are loaded. Physically and emotionally. There's ball four that'll force it a run. 6 2 Phillies. Not a call, strike three. Well, that may have been a pitcher's pitch. It's, pokes it to the right side. LeMayhew has it and not in time. A run scores as Real Muto crosses the plate. Gene Segura has hustled his way into a base hit now. Off the plate. And a race to second. He is out. He looked like he was there. And the inning is over. Using both sides of the plate. Flipping that breaking ball down and in there. And a fastball at the knees. A called strike three. That's his third strikeout. And with nobody on, I, I can totally understand it. I just don't believe in it when I know JT is trying to get that extra 90 feet. You may see that a lot more often uh, where where catchers are having to actually stay stay on on both their feet. That ball is smoked deep to left field and it is gone. Over Frenchies again. And hit, he did actually go to Aaron Judge Land. And I thought he would come back with something soft, but he tried to challenge him with that fastball inside and he didn't get it, he didn't get it there. And Glaber Torres made him pay for it. So it's a 7-5 game. Judges went 440. That one estimated at 428 over the, the roof of the Tiki Par. There's the curveball that you thought would come a little earlier. And he gets him looking. Side is retired. Four strikeouts for more. That's something he absolutely has to do now. Doing it. Um, and feeling like you need to do it mm -hmm. are two to totally different things. No balls and one strike to JT. Ground ball back towards short. LeMayhew, the second baseman, is there. And finally a quick inning. He was at first earlier. Swing and a miss. Blazing sunshine. Is that... We see videos all the time as LeMahieu lines one out to right, and here comes Harper, making a sprawling grab for the second out. Yeah, another really nice piece of hitting right here. I mean, this is pitch enough to to be able to really compete. Three-two pitch to Judge. He tried to check. They appeal. No swing. So ball four. Again, and and. Uh, this is what it's all, all about. You just yep. got to have fans out there to really enjoy this game. No doubt. The shortstop and a guy ends up on second base, mm. right? A ground ball. I mean, that doesn't happen very often. Well. Alec did that, um, and it led to runs for us, um, which, you know, sometimes but, uh, his plan is to start on Monday. 2-2 two -two to Torres, and that one is right down the chute for a call strike. I didn't do very well, Joe. I'm sorry. <laughs> he got hit, lot, hit around a little bit, but little I mean, bit. obviously he's a very good very good Yankees lineup as we talked about, but just zero in in the middle of the plate and just let his stuff work. Stanton did get the bat on the ball. Harper sprints in and is there to make the catch as he falls to his backside. Got out the 3 2 pitch coming to Voigt. And that ball four. Voigt's got a real short lead off first. He's still going to get the second on this one. He did it again. It'll be another wild pitch. Three and two. And ball four. So that puts runners on first and third with the Dodgers and the Rays. Runner goes, pitch is taken for a strike. I think that's the first breaking ball that he's thrown. He threw him another breaking ball. And he got a strikeout, so two outs. That one off the glove of Real Muto. They've got to play at the plate, and he is safe at home. They're going to say that Voigt got under the tag because the tag was up by the arm. It's a 7 6 game. That's the third wild pitch of the inning. 
Alvarado had three wild pitches all of last year. There's ball four. You know what Joe said. I'm not sure if Alex playing tomorrow in Toronto, which is a night game, by the so way. It can slide off much easier off the top of him. Back toward the middle and right at Gene Segura. The patience turned out to be the Yankees' benefit. To the right side. And one out here in the fifth. Gene Segura just shattered his bat. And LeMay who throws him out. Defense. Then he's he's a good guy to have on your on your staff because he's throwing enough strikes typically. And a call strike three. That's a little cheese. To get you know his at bats so he can work on his timing and be ready. Tried the same pitch. It's ball four. That puts two on with one out. Well, there's a cool picture of Mike Schmidt in his uh, Ohio uniform. Swing and a miss on Stan Lilly. Fly ball to right. Harper will head back toward the warning track. He's under it, and he makes the catch. The theory is you don't want to uh, run yourself into an out because outs are so precious. Man, that ball just ran in on the hands of Kutch. And he's retired. 1.69. And JT floats one out towards center. That's a base hit. That may be it for JT. We'll see. That one's hit out toward right field. That's going to drop in for a base hit. And it kicks away from Malone. Rounding third, heading for home is Verling, and he'll score. And Bryce Harper has his second hit of the night. It's 8 6 fills. Center field, it's not deep. Floreal is there. And the inning is over. The Phillies do get a run, though, on the RBI from Bryce Harper. You know, for me, it's it's more pitch selection than anything. So as long as I'm swinging with the right pitches, my swing usually feels pretty consistent. And this was the first time you caught Matt Moore in a game. Uh, what did you think uh, getting a chance to catch him? Is it cool to have fans that you can hear the booze from right now? <laughs> oh, it's amazing. I love it. I can't wait to get in Philly and hear some booze. Hopefully we play well enough we don't get any, yeah. but <laughs> I'd rather hear the cheers, obviously. So hopefully there's tons of cheers and very little. Went to the Angels and now found his way uh, back east. That went out to center field, Floreal. He glided in to make that catch, two outs. Bro throws out Garcia, and that's a quick inning for Luis Garcia. Here's Connor Brogdon, who's had a fantastic sprint, Temple University. There's that changeup. Torres gobbles it up, and in time. About tunneling is be able to, you know, not hitters not being able to distinguish what that pitch is there out is. of the hand, and it's and it's really spectacular. Johan Rojas lines one into left field for a base hit. And then Rojas will hold up at first against Tyler Lyons, the new pitcher for the Yankees. Throw with some funk. Rudder goes, and that bag is swiped rather easily. <laughs> Jankowski tried to hold. He went. I don't know if you can at the public school level like that. Well, you can, but you can't. Rudder goes to third. And Rojas has swiped second and third. And a line drive, base hit it to left field. There's the insurance run. Well, I give Rojas credit because his legs. Guys like JT Real Moto and Bryce Harper, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, opportunity to learn. That one's out to left field. It's deep, and it is gone. A three run home run, his first hit of the spring. Coming against the team that he grew up rooting for when he was a kid. Sounds like he's got some fans in the stands, too. I think I saw some old hoppy jerseys floating around there in Clearwater. And I think they're probably pretty excited about that swing. He's got a little breaking ball out over the plate, and he hammered it. And a called strike three. Wow, and a very delayed called strike three yeah. as well. He has had a very good spring. His fastball has been unbelievably high in velocity. 
Out to right field. That is well struck. Burling going back, and it is. Yeah. That guy made an attempt to make that catch, but he didn't make it. But he picked it up. Wow, Gittins just drilled that one out of the ballpark. He sure did. And De Los Santos has a. That's two pitches that probably should have been called strikes. Where are those and I'm not sure where they are. They throw to second. The runner goes. He's safe at second base. That was a pretty good throw. Inside ball four. Four. And this is one of those situations where this young man's got a very good arm, but he's got to be able to throw strikes and, and, and utilize the best parts of the play. The run will score. The throw goes to third. Missed the pitch. And there you go. Right down the chute. A call struck for justice. <laughs> Broke his bat. That's going to be a base hit. Another run will score. So Deglin has an RBI single. It's a 12-9 game. And that ball is rocketed down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball to the corner. One run is in. Phil Nevin's going to hold the runner at third. It's now a 12-10 game. And Duran has a double. De Los Santos really struggled. Uh, not only did he get some unfavorable calls, he yeah, had to throw strikes and give it up, then then to not throw strikes. Shot the other way. That's a fair ball. Went right past Williams. A run is in, or two runs are in, and it's a 12-12 game. How about that? The Yankees have pulled even 12. The 2-2 two -two pitch coming. Swing and miss. The inning is finally over, but the Yankees score six times. Here at the top of the ninth inning. I don't think so either, and yeah, unfortunately, pretty inauspicious. Defensively. Pretty much playing straight away with Williams. Opposite way. The ninth player was shaded toward the line, and he feels that one on one hop. Line drive base hit for Williams. A little bit of a lost art in the game. It is, and, and probably not only at this level. All right, so did the job there. That was a nice bunt. Absolutely, and he gave himself up thoroughly. He wasn't trying to, he wasn't like to see him drive this run in himself. There Just it like is. This. Into right field. The, the, play play. Play. the throw to the plate is got it. Yes. RBI walk off single. One for the Phils in the bottom of the ninth inning. That a baby. That is a nice job by the young man. He gets a fastball away, punches over against the shift. They don't really have a big shift on him, but he's got a lot of space over there.